All right, so we tested oh, continuity. Um, I ended up just taking all the wires out and putting them back into the plug. Uh, there was some corrosion inside. When I pulled it off, you can tell after this cover comes off right here, these three comes off, this cover will slide back and you can pull this plug inside here all the way out and then get to uh, these wires in the back here that are going into this hubble plug. There was some corrosion, so I stripped them clean uh, with my strippers and I um, put them back in. So I'm gonna go ahead and test continuity real quick and see where we're at, you yeah. know. Test two positives, and there is 4.331. So there's going to be kilo ohms. I'm in kilo ohms right now, and saying there is continuity between these two wires, so that's not a good sign. And there's nothing. Well, there's so let's see if there's enough for it to beep. This is auto ranging. So let's test it. Let's beep it on there. So let's go to beep style here. Nothing. Nothing. Let's switch these two here. So there's no short to ground anywhere. I'm checking each one, see if there might be short to ground. And there's not. So that's good. So technically this should work. So we got power on. What we can do here is go to AC volts. It's auto ranging. Got this plug. Let's see how many volts we got. Going through this plug here. Fucking gross to snap on. Piece of shit. Take these off. I'll stick these down in here. Let's see what we got. So we got. Twenty one. You can see that on there or not part not I'm blocking it's kind of shadowing it. So we got one nineteen. One twenty. So we're good there. So I might as well go ahead and try this at all. I hope we can get it working. We're just gonna get a brand new, brand new plug. So it's probably internal. So I'm gonna order a brand new Hubble plug, and uh, I think we might have one here in the shop. So I will go ahead and replace that. Well, that was like a at least a 20 minute ordeal, and um, you know, trial and error. 